unfortunately, we've got a lot going on here at home behind the scenes. So I wasn't able to go down to Dallas this week for the Dallas toy preview. Um, but when I was there last year, I kept seeing posters for these dolls and I couldn't get into the room where the prototypes were and I was really bummed. And then I didn't see them at Toy Fair either. But then I'm walking through Toys R Us and all of a sudden I see Regal Academy dolls. I'm like, oh my gosh, those are the dolls that I wanted to see that I couldn't get in to see. And so today we're going to meet our very first Regal Academy doll in Mommy's Doll Corner. I know absolutely nothing about Regal Academy. I know zero. It reminds me a lot of Winx, and I'm going to tell you why. It's the artwork. Look at this artwork right here. Now, if you were not with me during the Mommy and Gracie show, early days, you don't know that Gracie and I are huge Winx Club fans, but the original Winx Club. Not to be very clear. If this girl doesn't look like Stella from Winx Club, it's, it's amazing. And even some of these characters. So this is Rose Cinderella. So I think Regal Academy is going for the, and this is, this doll is Magical Rose. She's for ages five and up. Magical Rose, I picked her because I love the name Rose because it was my grandma's name. And I think that's a pig and she comes with a light up wand. They had all different kinds of Regal Academy dolls and I was really, really excited. And uh, these are made, uh, let's see, Alpha Group, Aldi, and I think Rainbow, which might be the same company that was distributing Winx Club. I suspect if we look online, we can find episodes of this. I'm just saying, but man, that girl looks like Stella. Rose looks like Stella. Oh, that's so cute. So her wand lights up. So the story, according to the back of the box for Regal Academy is, Rose is a modern teenager who never lost her love of fairy tales. Having grown up on Earth, she constantly experiences a culture shock between her modern shoe-filled life on Earth and the magical, mysterious fairy tale land. She is a positive girl who thinks that everything is great all the time. Sound like Bloom? Gardenia? Anyone? Anyone feeling a vibe? And then her, the other people in the show are Astoria Rapunzel, Hawk Snow White, who is, it looks like he's a boy, Joy Lefrog, Travis Beast, and Vicky Broomstick. And I can tell you just from Vicky's picture, just from the look on Vicky's face, Vicky's gonna be the mean girl. So, and Rose's magical pet. Oh, it's a mouse. I said it was a pig, so sorry. It's a mouse. And it's funny because everything's in English and French and I so want to. Um, so you can visit regalacademy.com to begin your own regal adventure or you can visit regalacademy.com pour commencer votre propre adventure royale. That was pretty bad. So I'm going to get her out of the box. Let's take a look at her. And if you know stuff about Regal Academy, let me know. I'm definitely gonna go check it out and try and watch it. If it's like Winx Club, I'm in. I'm so in because I don't like the new Winx Club, like the last two versions of Winx Club. I'm, 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 I'm Winx Club from back when Aisha was Layla, like Layla and the Pixies, like, you know, way back then, way back then. You know, Dark R, oh my gosh, you know, Tritanus and his, his, his black diarrhea was like, really, I think we jumped a shark literally with uh, Tritanus, but, um, oh my gosh, Icy and, oh, oh my God, the tricks. Ah! Anyway, I could go on and on about Winx Club. Let me get her out of the box and let's take a look at Rose from Regal. And she's out of the box. The first thing that really caught my eye with Rose was just the color palette. It's just so bright and cheerful. And the second thing that got me was her face paint. Let's zoom in. I am absolutely in love with this girl's face. I love these eyes absolutely love these eyes. I love the lip color. I love the slight blush to her cheeks. I think she's just so pretty. I just, I really, I mean, even though she's not like a high-end doll and they're not rooted eyelashes and all that, I still think she's super pretty. I love the color of her hair and she's got this little bit of a headband here 
and then her hair is just sort of, you know, it's nothing, we're not, we're nothing to write home about, but it's really pretty color. It's a pretty nice texture that wasn't all box hair. This is her top and it is molded on. So as you can see, it is molded on plastic. This also snaps off, so we can probably change these out. So underneath that, she's wearing this. Let me put this back on. There we go. But I really like the colors of this. And she's got gauntlets now. What's really cool is that she's articulated at her shoulders, her elbows, not her hands. She's also articulated at her knees. I'm loving the ruffle situation we have going on over here. And then the drop hem in the back. So we get this little tiny bit of a gown-ish effect. Hello, I'm back on the other side here. So I think she's really, really pretty, guys. I really do. As I said, I don't really know anything about her. I thought the other dolls were really pretty too. I'm gonna look up the price. They weren't that expensive. She was more expensive because she came with accessories, like her little friend who I'm going to call Gus Gus. Even though I originally called you a pig because you're a little on the chunky side, I've decided that you're Gus Gus, and that's why. Look, he's even got the little, he's even got a little squiggly tail. He's really cute, so she's got her friend. And then she has her light up wand, which is a pumpkin. Um, are you lighting up? It's, yeah, it lights up at the top. So she's got this little light up wand. It works for purposes of this video. <laughs> but now I can't push the button. You're hopeless, you know that? I know, I know. I need Gracie. I know, I know. So this is Rose Cinderella? Rose, yeah, from uh, Regal Academy. I think she's really pretty. I really do. Um, I have to go look at the other ones to see if I want more of them. Her, her face makes me just really, really happy. I think she's very, very pretty. And she definitely reminds me of Stella from Winx Club. So yeah, we're gonna do a poll. Does she look like Stella from Winx Club? Let me know by voting in the poll. And thank you all so much for watching. Let me know if you know anything about Regal Academy and these dolls. And I will see you again. See, her hair's really good. See you again real soon. Love you. Bye.